Well, hello there. If you don't know who I am, right? I'm Kim Andrews from the Celtic Eye and I do progressive rock with Celtic harmonies and I'm going to share some of those songs with you as well just to let you hear some. Maybe I'll be singing song, you never know. And it's great that we're able to come together, have a chat, get in touch with each other. Yes, I do music. I also do art and I do some guitar tutorials as well. So really great um, to be able to do those things and to share those things because if you don't share things, how are people supposed to know what, you know what you can do and how you can develop as a person and as an artist as well. So at the minute I'm doing, I'm trying to get a, like a compilation of songs together, um, some they call that an album. And um, basically I have six songs finished, right? I'm going to put one more now for you. And you can let me know if you can hear that, I might have to turn it up. Turning down my music a bit because I can't hear myself. I see them now, watching and waiting. I see them now, side the path that binds me. I see them now, in the midst of my dreams. I see them now, looking for me time. It's around us now, and shadows fall. Where the path is called before the dawn, the shadows fall. So anyway, um, another six songs we're doing at the minute, and it's all got to do with sorting them out, getting them recorded, getting the guitar solos recorded, and um, getting the riffs recorded and just basically finalising everything, doing the, the vocals and doing all the, you know, um, the Celtic harmonies and stuff like that. So it'll take a wee while, but um, yeah, it's coming along. And uh, I'm really pleased with how it's coming along. The case is the 12 songs I'm trying to do for this collection all together and it'll take a little bit of time but um, it's getting there. With things where they are, you can only, I'm dealing with my own music anyway, so you are you tend to just, you know, do it at home. Um, so I record at home, do all my own recording, my own mixing and things like that, so it takes a bit of time so it'll take longer. But um, I'm just glad the way it's working out and really pleased how it's going. But um, I hope that, uh, you know, getting it finalised um, in the not too distant future would be really great. But um, there are some questions that some people wanted to ask me and um, I wrote them down. So um, it just shows you that, you know, you can't just keep building on your music and just do what you can when you can as well. You get there in the end, it might take a bit longer, but not to worry. Um, so, a question from James Corsaveria. Corsaveria, I think his name is. Sorry, James, if I got your name wrong there. But James is asking who my favorite singers are and bands are. Right, for example, White Snake really love White Snake and um, I've, I've known about White Snake since I was 18 and just love White Snake, absolutely brilliant band and um, I've been to so many other concerts as well. So you don't know what to expect sometimes with maybe bands that you like because they're, they're doing so many things all the time and they're just, um, you know, uh, doing so many gigs and stuff and you're really into them and just think they're great. but. 
Um, yeah, I really, really love White Snake, and uh, and then there's also Dio, of course. Ah, oh, Dio is just amazing. And um, but anyway, it just shows you too about the many albums that they're doing and the, the stuff that Dio did. It was just absolutely fantastic. Just love his voice. Uh, he's got that real sound to his voice. It's just fantastic. And then you've got um, Nightwish, of course, and. Uh, it's a band that I haven't been really into before, I've just got more into them and they're just amazing. I mean, their stuff live is just fantastic. I, I don't know what sort of stuff you're liking too. Um, you know, if you're into these type of bands as well, you can let me know. Yeah, really love Nightwish, I think they're a great band. And uh, just the, the vocals of Fleur and all, it's just fantastic. Uh, guitars are amazing and it's, it's just fantastic. I mean. Then there's Iron Maiden. I mean, Iron Maiden's been going for years, and I've I've got most of their albums. <laughs> I know I've got most of their albums. I can't believe it. It's just unbelievable. Um, yeah, got loads of albums from them. Then I love Robert Palmer, of course, and he's got this real soul voice. Um, love him from his bit eighteen as well. Um, Nan is no longer with us, sadly, but a really fantastic singer, a really deep sound his voice and he can hit all these notes and do all these runs. He's just amazing. Seeing all these bands and all these singers and real, really brilliant guitar players, of course, Joe Satriani. And they do influence you, they, they influence you as a person and growing up with them and um, just amazing sounds, amazing guys playing. I mean, they're absolutely fantastic. And... Um, but thanks Catherine and thank you to Phil as well. So that song there, The Shadows Fall, of course, is all about the shadows fall. I mean these times we're we're not we're gonna get through this. We're gonna get um through to the other end of the cycle here. Uh things shouldn't stay the same. Things may change as well, but um it's all about this song's all about your obstacles and how you can overcome those obstacles by facing them head on and just being able to Continue on with your music. So I've been working on six songs and I have completed six songs. So the first six songs is completed with some guitar solos, um, guitar riffs and my styles like um, progressive rock or you could just say rock really uh, with the riffs, heavy riffs, guitar solos and stuff like that. And um, and then the Celtic harmonies. I'll just put on another song here, let you hear it. Um, my song is um, the Shadows Fall song. It was about your own obstacles and stuff like that. And um, this song is it's about um, optimism. So I've just turned up the sound there for the, the track. about 10 minutes long but we're not going to like go through all that but uh, it's pretty cool how it's worked out for me. In the night where the stars shine down lost in a dream in the background there guys um, but uh, 
Yep, so the songs are coming on and they're getting there. It's um, just a matter of keep going through them, going through each stage and getting through your, you know, your videos and for it. And I always record myself when I'm doing a, you know, a video for the solo and stuff like that, just so I can show it to people and you can, you know, see, you can see really what's going on with the song. Um, in case you're wondering why I'm looking up here, there's another camera. So I'm recording this as well, so, um, which is cool. So don't worry about sound and stuff, guys. Um, hopefully it'll be okay in the end. I'll upload a video of some sort. So anyway, um, yeah, this, uh, this song is about 10 minutes long, but it's, um, I'll just turn it down a bit. About 10 minutes long, but um, it just needed to be. At, um, just the way it was working out for me, the, the way the solos were going and the way the guitar riffs were heading out and I was trying different things for the vocals. I mean it's not perfect or anything because I'm just doing it from home but it's as perfect as I can get it and if we're having to work from home I mean this is what we're having to do anyway. So um, yeah really cool but it's getting there eventually but um, it just takes a wee while. And, uh, I hope that there's more people can come on. I know somebody's just on there, but I hope more people can come on. Thanks guys for that, for liking the video. I hope you can hear me still. Um, so anyway, yeah, White Snake Dale, Nightwish, Iron Maiden, of course, Robert Palmer, Joe Satriani, um, basically loads of people to say like, and then you've Dead Daisies and you've got, uh, Revolution Saints and all, it's just fantastic. All of the music's just brilliant. Love all that stuff. And um, a big shout out then to Ken Vardy. Ken, if you're listening to this, maybe at some point you can maybe hear me. Um, big shout out to you, mate. And uh, he says, when am I going on the road? Playing live videos. And he, you know, he wants to know when that would happen. Um, basically, the way things are, nobody's going on the road right now. I mean, some guys have literally having to just wait and see what is happening with their, you know, with their tours and stuff like that. Me personally, I can't really go and do, you know, live um, gigs because of, you know, um, family commitments. Um, I have elderly. Uh, ill parents and um, and also I've got my own um, injuries from years ago. I don't want to go into it but I've just got a lot of injuries and I just like to work from home and do things that way and then with the family commitments as well it narrows things down a bit so I can only do what I can so um, which is cool. I don't mind because I can I still be creative, you guys can still be creative, uh, you can, you know, upload your videos, upload your art, upload, you know, different things like that, so um, don't worry about it, you know, and just do what you can when you can, that's what I've learned, uh, just to, you know, stay focused and just do your, your own work in your own way and just develop yourself as a person and develop, you know, your interests and all that sort of thing. So, um, good question from Ken Farley. I'd love to be gigging. I mean, with my own personal injuries, I can do maybe a few songs at once, you know, playing the guitar, one to two songs, that type of thing. Singing, I could sing without using the guitar. Um, a bit longer, but it's having the stamina with your injuries, so um, it's the way it is, and not a lot I can do about it, and stuff like that, but you know, you, you just do what you can, guys, I mean, just um, follow your own path, and follow how you want to do something, don't go worrying about what everybody else is doing. So, um, there's a few people there, I think, are maybe linking on there. Um, like in the video guys so hopefully people can hear me um, which I hope you can guys that would be amazing but um, I'll do an Ori Bella song
to the sky you will find where I've been destiny calls me to fight for you and me <laughs> so this is the harder part of this part uh, the chorus there so it's a bit of a mixture of that song, but I hope you dig it. And um, I'll just give a wee shout out to a few people there who's come on. Dave Zifigish, I can't say it, I'm sorry if I can't say it right. And um, Donald Grun, that's really cool guys. And thank you to Catherine for helping me with my tech. <laughs> and Phil Watson. So thank you guys for that, that's amazing. Um, even for you guys to come on here, that's just fantastic. I really enjoy that. Um, so anyway, I'm thinking about maybe doing a guitar page of some sort, whether it's a group page, you know, a group page or a group page or a Facebook page um, to maybe do some, you know, do some guitar instrumentals or lessons of some done already can maybe put up there but if you would like that put that wee um, question out there to you guys you maybe would want to come along and enjoy a bit of guitar lessons and stuff like that or, or not I don't know uh, put that out to you you can let me know what you think um, in case you're wondering there's another camera up here I'm looking at so um, yeah <laughs> If you want to ask me anything else, that would be awesome. Um, ask me any questions you want, of course, about music or anything that we've been, I've mentioned about, guys. That would be awesome. There's another song here, and I don't want to give you the names of the songs just yet because, um, basically, you know, I want to keep them quiet until, you know, I have them ready to let you all hear. And I hope you can see me, guys, and all that. But, um, yeah, really cool. And um, I'll just turn this one up a bit. It starts off like with a soft sort of drum. I was actually playing the boron on that uh, bit of music there. And uh, I'm not a boron player or anything, but you know, it's cool anyway, just to try something new as well, which is, which is awesome. I'm just like you hear this bit of music. To what the veil of tears and begin my journey far from you. When we meet again, I can never tell. But before the end, the search began. When the storm blows, I will never know what the future holds before us. The cold stones lay before a throne in a time before the dragon rolls. So anyway guys, well thank you for coming along. Those who have came along, thank you again. And um, Thanks for joining me. It's really nice to hear from you. I'll just turn that down a wee bit. It's just really nice to hear from you. So thank you again to Catherine and thank you again to Phil. And cheers there to Ken Vardy for his question. And also cheers to James Corvossier. I think that's it. James Corvossier. So thank you for your questions, guys. Really appreciate it. And thanks again. And um, I'll say goodbye for now and just maybe see you again and I'm sure I'll see you again. Of course I will, why not? And it was really fun. I, I just really enjoyed doing this today and um, I hope you will too. Uh, with sound of course, so maybe you'll you'll hear some sound. <laughs> Thanks again guys and I'll see you next time. 
and uh, take care for now and I wish you well and, um, and all the best and stay safe out there by the way. Just keep listening to music and do stuff that you like to do for your own mental health, do stuff you like to do and um, whether it's your guitar, your drums, you know, listen to music, watch some films, enjoy this time at home, just really enjoy it and just, you know, get through this as best as possible. And I wish you all the very best and have a lovely day and maybe see you again as well and thanks again. Thank you guys. All the best. Bye. Bye.